And I felt them little fuzzies on my hand. I opened up and I jumped off. I was like, ah! Good morning! Today I'm going to try something a little weird. I want to go on a run, so I know my gym's not going to be open. And I've had these beets in my refridge for way too long, honestly. The greens are kind of floppy. The beets are probably still good themselves. But I want to juice these three beets, and then blend it up with some bananas, and then go on a run. And hopefully not throw up. We'll see how that goes. on beets, bananas, and strawberries. I decided to throw those in there. Because I'd probably do it again. It's not too bad. You can't taste the beet too much. And it's pretty sweet. Not complaining. And it looks cool. Look at that color. Look at that color. Definitely pukeable though. We'll see. Beetroot always makes me feel really zingy. You'll get that? Alright, so I just finished that. Go to clean that, get some water. And I'm headed for my run. Seven miles. I need some water now. Water. That took some will right there. And I don't know, there's something about the extra heat. Or it's like, I didn't want to keep going, but I kept going. I trudged through it. And I finished, but it was hard. Hardest run so far. <laughs> Time to finish off eating these acid bananas, man. Look at those things. I just had like a a bunch of bundles this big this week for some reason. Thanks, Whole Foods. I've been trying to figure out how I can make an impact on this planet, and it's it seems like just a, a crazy thing to think about. How can you make change on this huge planet? Fish being a small little ant. And I talked a little bit about how if you want to change the world, you have to start with yourself because you are inevitably the world. You are one with the world. So if you start with yourself, you can start changing everything around you. And people that you change can start changing people. And it's a big trickle effect. And you, you can constantly do that. And I've been trying to figure out how I can I can do that. And I realized that YouTube is probably the best and easiest way I can do that. I can reach so many people over the internet and I probably haven't changed any lives yet, but maybe in the future I can, um, I'll have some kind of testimony saying that I've changed some lives and I hope I do get that. And that would really, really just fire me up to keep doing it because that's what I want. I want there to be change in this world. I want there to be better things. I want to wake up every day and know that I'm going to be happy and that a bunch of people are going to be happy doing the same thing I'm doing. I feel like that, that's a realistic goal. That's something I can work for and work towards, definitely. So I was sitting on the trampoline getting my tan on and there was this little spider poking its head out of one of the springs. So it had a little house in there or something. It kept poking its head out. And it would crawl into the trampoline, I'd, I'd hit the trampoline, so it'd go back in to his house and leave me alone. And I did it like four times, and he still kept trying to come after me. He wanted to get to me for some weird reason. But uh, one time I closed my eyes, and he snuck past me, I didn't see him. And he ended up on my arm. It was a big, like, probably like little tarantula looking spider, all fuzzy. And I felt them little fuzzies on my head, I opened up and I jumped off, I was like, ah! <laughs> and, uh, yeah. You got the better of me today. I know where he lives now. Hey man, how's that ankle? Oh, it really hurts. Really What'd you do hurts. all day? Been standing around, walking around, pointing fingers. You do this, you do that, I'll return to dominance. <laughs> you wanna go for a vegan run? Nah man, that's why I don't run right there. I went on a run, first run in two months, or three months, probably longer, and I fell and busted my ankle, and that's why I don't run. That sucks. Alright, we can go now. As you saw, the patient 
is uh, he's, he can walk at least. I just finished dinner, had some potatoes and rice, and I am going to call it a day right here. I hope you had a great day. I had a great day, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.